Hi, welcome to my presentation. The HEC TRIO Education Opportunity Center Scholarship Search Program. Are you ready? What are HEC TRIO Education Opportunity Centers? My name is Dorothy Smith, Client Service Assistant to Educational Opportunity Centers, EOC, help participants apply for financial aid, which includes conducting a scholarship search. In this presentation, I'm going to show you a short video that provide you with a basic review of what a scholarship is, why you need one or two, and the types of scholarships that are available. I'm going to spend the remainder of the presentation showing you how the EOC can assist you in conducting a scholarship search. What is a scholarship? Meet Joe. He's your typical high school student. Like most ambitious students, Joe wants to go to an Ivy League college. However, college education is very expensive these days and not many students can afford it. Joe explained his financial situation to his guidance counselor, Mr. Wilson, who advised him to apply for a scholarship. A scholarship is financial aid provided to students. Some students get a scholarship because they are great in academics or excel in sports. These are called merit-based scholarships. There are some scholarships that are given to students who are not so well-to-do economically. These are called need-based scholarships. In addition to these, there are also student-specific scholarships which are given out depending on the race, gender, medical history, and many such student-specific factors. For example, the Gates Millennium Scholars Program is a minority scholarship funded by Bill and Melinda Gates for excellent African American, American Indian, and Latino students who enroll in college. Career-specific scholarships are scholarships that are given out to students pursuing a particular career. Many schools in the United States give future nurses full scholarships to enter the field, especially if the student intends to work in a high-need community. Finally, we have the college-specific scholarships. College-specific scholarships are offered by individual colleges and universities to highly qualified applicants. These scholarships, given on the basis of academic and personal achievement, usually result in either a full ride to the college or for a reduced rate of tuition. Like a grant, a scholarship doesn't need to be repaid. So, what's the best way to get a scholarship? Applying for scholarships is time consuming, and so you need to find and apply for those where you have the best shot at winning. Chances of getting a local scholarship are much higher than a national or state scholarship, so it makes sense to apply for those. Remember that you do not need to pay anything to apply for a scholarship, so if you come across any that are asking for money, then be assured that is a scam. Almost all scholarships will require you to submit a recommendation letter with your application. Find teachers or counselors who know you well to write one up for you. Some scholarships also require you to write an essay. Make sure to include details about yourself that may be unique from other applicants, as this will increase the chances of you getting selected. Look at Joe now. He's all excited about going to college, now that he's got his scholarship. This video was brought to you by scholarshipsandgrants.us. ATC TRIO EOC scholarship search process, step one, needs assessment. We ask you questions about your journey. Where are you going to school locally or out of state? What is your intended major? How much financial aid do you need? What type of school will you attend? Two year, four year, vocational, technical. When do you plan on enrolling? We ask you questions about yourself and what activities are you involved in school? Do you participate in extracurricular activities? Are you part of any organization, clubs, religious groups, professional organizations? Do you have any hobbies? Do you have any special characteristics, traits, talents? What's your GPA, ACT score, SAT score? There are many scholarship opportunities available to students based on traits such as green eye, red hair, being left-handed, living in a certain county, 
have a certain ancestry, being a member of a specific group. The self-assessment is an ongoing process to find any and all possible scholarship opportunities. Researching where to search. Make sure scholarship information at Make sure scholarship information and offers you receive are legitimate. And remember that you don't have to pay to find scholarships or other financial aid. Check out the studentaid.gov website for information on how to avoid scams. These free resources are another way to get information about scholarships. The financial aid office at a college or career school, a high school or trio counselor, that's me. The U.S. Department of Labor's U.S. Department of Education student aid.gov site. Researching where to search. Use your state grant agency just such as Isaac or MDHE, your library reference section, foundations, religious or community organizations, local businesses or civic groups, organizations including professional associations related to your field of interest, intensity, in, ethnicity-based organizations such as United Negro College Fund, your employer or your parents' employer. The search, are you ready? Employer business scholarship. We have examples below, such as Boeing University Relations, Ronald McDonald, Chaser Program 2021, Coca-Cola Scholarship, Scholars Foundation, College University Scholarship examples. We have here listed St. Louis Community College Scholarships, Southwestern Illinois Community College, College Scholarships, College University Scholarship examples, University of Missouri St. Louis Scholarships, Southern Illinois University Edwardsville Scholarships, local community or privately sponsored scholarship examples, Marguerite Ross Barnett Memorial Scholarship, Missouri 2020 Scholarships, Purdy Emerging Leaders Scholarships, the ATC Trio Educational Opportunity Center Scholarship Search Program, Are You Ready? Presented by Ms. Dorothy Smith, Client Service Assistant to SIUE East St. Louis Campus. For more information, please contact me, dsmith at hecstl.com or my office number at 618-874-8714 or you can reach me by cell 618-974-7359. I hope this information was helpful and thank you for attending my presentation.